Welcome back everybody. In this one I'll be showing you Mastcam Z's first 360 degree panorama put together by the NASA team. These are stitched together from photographs taken on Sol 3. In my previous video I showed you some anomalies identified in the individual photographs. In this one I'll be showing you these anomalies in the panorama and we'll be able to guesstimate how big they are as well. We'll be checking out this over here first and that object over there NASA says is about 50 centimeters across which makes it about a half a meter in length. So let's go ahead and open that panorama check out that artifact that NASA is showing us so look at the distance to this object and uh, that's roughly a half a meter the distance between those two boulders so that anomaly out there is not too big let's go out further to the background way at the back there that's the strange multi-layered object I showed you it looks like it's a tombstone in the shape of a tombstone so if we consider the distance from the rover which is up here to that point there it's much further from here to there so that object in the background there can't be smaller than I'd say a half a meter across I would say it's about a meter and a half wide and about two to three meters tall roughly speaking and then uh, let's check out the strange rectangular block that's out here somewhere as well there it is folks and you can see relatively speaking it's much bigger than the anomaly we just checked out. So look at the distance from there to there and then from here to here. So that there is a lot further folks. I'd say it's about four times, five times further which makes that in my opinion five meters long. I want to see if it shows up in a high res high rise photograph. I haven't seen a high rise photograph of this particular landing site yet on the high rise catalog but I'll be keeping an eye on that one guys and then let's not forget the layered anomalies out here to the left as I say guys and girls this looks like two rectangular parts smaller one lying diagonally across this one at the bottom you can see the shadow that the one on top costs it's got two straight edges and a right angle there and then this piece with a right angle there it looks almost as if it's bent up on the sides and it's got that strange bright material on the top Sort of parallel with this one side. It looks almost like those anomalies I've shown you in the past, taken from orbit with the MRO, where we have the larger base structures with these small parts or protrusions or objects on top. It looks almost like that. And that there would be, let's see, about a meter and a half wide, meter wide. I'm not sure. So that's it for this one. I'll include the link to the panorama in the video description below. Thanks again for watching. Do let me know what you think the sizes of these objects might be.